In this video, I will show you guys all of the new features and changes in this event week. So this new event week has just begun today, which is July 25th, and everything in this event will be available until July 31st. Now in the short paragraph, we can see that the new pizza deliveries are available, and there is also a new community challenge where all players will need to deliver 10 million pizzas, and if done, this will reward everyone with a pizza this tea. This event also debuts LS tags, which which will be a new daily collectible along with the vapid dominator fx for another short overview of what we have got in terms of some drip fed content we have the new pizza delivery for pizza this the new ls tags daily collectible and two new drip fed vehicles which will be the vapid dominator fx and the pegasi pizza boy which will be available for all players for the new weekly challenge this week we have complete free pizza deliveries to receive one hundred thousand dollars. now i do wonder what the pizza delivery payouts will be i reckon it will be very similar to the taxi work payouts overall i do like this i think this is pretty funny and cool it is a shame that we did not see this before in the past of gta but moving on to some bonus money guys we first of all have some double money and four times rp on transform races and we also have just some standard double money and rp on the stockpile adversary mode and that will be all of the bonus money for this event i really wish that we did have a few more things with some bonuses at least just just one business but i guess the drip fed content might make up for that i mean i'm not expecting to make millions of dollars delivering pizzas but this now brings us to the discounts guys we first of all have a 40 percent off work jackets and shirts and following this on for some vehicle discounts this week you guys can find a 30 percent discount on all of these vehicles i probably think that the best vehicle here is the vapid unmarked cruiser if you guys have checked the prices for these police vehicles you will know that they are costing up upwards of three million dollars i believe some of them are even more than that and for our final discounts we have the gun van primary discounts we have a 30 percent off the open atomizer and a 40 percent off for gta plus members on the heavy rifle i would recommend getting the open atomizer it can actually help you guys a lot in gta online for example if you guys crash your car and it is stuck the open atomizer can come in super useful inside the salvage yard this week we have these salvage yard robberies we have the mctony robbery for the grotty turismo classic which will be the top tier vehicle the gangbanger robbery for the anis euros which is the standard vehicle and the podium robbery for the bravado greenwood which of course is the low tier vehicle so if you guys earn a salvage yard definitely get these things done it is pretty much just a free one million dollars and of course without any business bonuses i would definitely suggest that you guys do this for the casino's lucky wheel podium vehicle we have the ruiner zz8 now i'm not going to lie to you guys i had no idea this was even a vehicle i feel like rockstar have so many different variations of different vehicles but just remember you can just spin the lucky wheel and with some luck you can get this for completely free for the ls car meet prize ride we have the grotty cheetah classic and if you guys want to get this vehicle you need to place top five in the ls car meet series for two days in a row for all of simeon's auto shop vehicles we have all of them on screen here i would probably recommend the coil cyclone but of course with vehicles it really comes down to your personal preference and sometimes some of these vehicles might have been removed by rockstar in the past which will make it an ideal time to maybe pick one of them up at the luxury autos dealership we have these two vehicles in my opinion the d1 is probably the better one here i just absolutely love how the d1 looks i already have this vehicle so i will probably end up getting the dominator fx and now going all the way back over to the ls car meet we have the re 7b the bravado buffalo s and the grotty carbon Azar, which i definitely have not said right and for our premium test ride vehicle which is the hsw test ride we have the grotty turismo classic just remember you can only get this on the next gen consoles with the next gen version of gta online i believe rockstar call it the expanded and enhanced edition and last but not least guys we have the final thing in this event which will be the time trials the premium race this week is art to art the standard time trial is pillbox hill and the hsw time trial is terminal to chiliad mountain state wilderness what do you guys think overall about this event week personally i like the fact that we are getting these drip fed things but in terms of making a lot of money this week it might not be the best time but yeah guys let me know your thoughts on this event in the comments down below what do you guys like most from this whole event week i also really like the fact that rockstar are bringing back these community challenges i cannot even remember the last time they had one but as always guys if you went on to enjoy this 
this video or found it useful in some way, shape or form, make sure to leave a like. I really appreciate your support. And if you are new here, subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss a video. Finally, guys, stay safe. Thanks for watching and I will catch you in the next one.